Good morning everyone. This is the market roundup with Kotak Mutual Fund as of 26th November 2021. To start with, we have updates for you on the debt market. Yesterday, there was a GSEC auction of 24,000 crore rupees wherein the 2035 GSEC cutoff came at 6.74% and the 2051 GSEC cutoff came at 6.95%. The benchmark 10-year GSEC rallied by 4 basis points to close at 6.33%. And the five year GSEC rallied by five basis points to close at 5.65%. In the shorter end of the yield curve, the three month CP and the one year segment closed flat at 3.70% and 4.35%, respectively. In the longer end of the yield curve, the three year AAA segment rallied by three basis points to close at 5.34%, and the five year segment also rallied by three basis points to close at 6.05%. The liquidity in the banking system is approximately 7.30 lakh crore rupees. Moving on to the updates on the equity market. The benchmark indices closed in red with the Nifty 50 losing 2.91% to hit a new one month low and BSE Sensex lost 2.87% marking the worst day for both indices since April 12th. While in the broader market, the mid cap index fell by 3.25% and the small cap index lost 2.89%. In the sectoral indices, Nifty Pharma gained 1.70% and Nifty Metal closed in the red by 5.34%. Yesterday, we saw net selling from the FIIs to the tune of 5,786 crore rupees and the DIIs bought 2,294 crore rupees. In other news, global rating agency Moody's has given a strong forecast for India's GDP for FY22 to be at 9.3% and FY23 to be at 7.9%. In currency update, yesterday the rupee depreciated by 37 basis points to close at 74.89 against the US dollar. In commodity update, gold was trading at 1,807 US dollars per ounce and WTI crude was trading at 73.08 US dollars per barrel. That's it for the day. Thank you for listening and have a safe day ahead. For regular updates, please subscribe to our social media pages. Mutual fund investments are subject to market risks. Read all scheme-related documents carefully.